Hey guys, so for today's video, we are in my kitchen, which is very messy. I'm not gonna show you guys what's going on back here, but it's messy. It is officially day nine of my 12 days of Christmas. Like I've said before, I am doing this 12 days of Christmas where I am doing one video every day for 12 days leading up to Christmas. And for today's video, I decided to show you guys how to make wine hot chocolate. You guys, this stuff, you don't even know. This hot chocolate in particular is probably my favorite hot chocolate. It is amazing. For those of you that don't drink wine though, this still works for you guys. You just don't add the wine in and it's still an amazing cup of hot chocolate. I guarantee you. You guys are gonna love it. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoy it. Let's go ahead and make some hot chocolate. So the ingredients you'll need, you're gonna need some red wine. You can use any kind of milk for this. I personally just prefer almond milk because I'm trying not to drink milk anymore. Some white sugar, salt, vanilla extract, and then of course your chocolate chips. I prefer dark chocolate chocolate chips, but you can use any types of chocolate chips you prefer. I also have the Ghirardelli here on hand because that chocolate is amazing. So the first thing you're going to do, I just go ahead and measure out the almond milk by the cup I'm using. And I'm just going to go ahead and pour some of the almond milk into that cup. Not all the way to the top though, because you're still going to need enough room for the red wine. And then you're going to go ahead and just add that into your pot. Once the milk starts to steam, you're going to go ahead and start adding in your chocolate chips. You're going to add about one third cup of chocolate chips to your mixture and then I went ahead and added in just a little bit more of the Ghirardelli one just because it is bite sized and they're tiny so I added in about three or four of those for this part you're gonna add in just a little bit of sugar Personally, I don't like having a lot of sugar but this is to your preference if you prefer having more sugar go ahead and add in more I'm just gonna add in about maybe two teaspoons worth of sugar next I'm gonna add in about a teaspoon of vanilla and then I'm also gonna add in just a pinch of salt and I'm just gonna go ahead and whisk all those flavors to together and I'm gonna keep whisking until everything starts to mix in well together once everything's all mixed together you don't want the water to boil you just want your milk to look steamed so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna turn off your stove you're just gonna let that sit and then you're gonna add in about a half a cup of red wine if you don't want wine in your hot chocolate you can go ahead and skip this step and enjoy it now add some whipped cream whatever you like on top I decided to go ahead and add in red wine because I want to show you guys how to make red wine hot chocolate so you're gonna go ahead and add in the red wine and then you're gonna whisk all those flavors together. And you're gonna make sure it's whisked in really well. Then you're just gonna go ahead and add in your hot chocolate to your cup, as I'm doing very messily here. I'm sorry, you guys. I clean it up later, it's okay. And now your hot chocolate is ready for you to enjoy. If you wanna add whipped cream or anything like that, go ahead by all means. I decided not to, because I like it plain usually. Mm. This is so freaking good. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I thought this was something that would be a lot of fun to make. Me and my roommate love making this. It's so much fun and it's so good. It's the perfect drink if you're having one of those nights where you're craving something sweet, but you also want to get a little bit tipsy. It's perfect. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe if you guys haven't already so that way you can stay tuned for the rest of my 12 days of Christmas I have going on on my channel. Have a great rest of your night or day wherever you guys may be and I'll see you in my next video. And remember, Stay weird, my friends. Bye, you guys. Mm-hmm. Oh, so good.